What is up everyone, Garrett Lewis here and welcome back to Scooby-Doo and the Cyber Chase. So we left off last time, we finished off the first stage, Classic Japan. And um, as you know, this is part two, so let me know in the comments below if you're enjoying the game so far. If so, then I might actually continue to do this game a lot more and I might do other Scooby-Doo games if you um, enjoy this series. So today we're going on to the next stage, stage two, which is the Ancient Rome. Three levels as normal, and um, yeah, I'll be explaining more how, about more how, how much I love this, been loving this game in my childhood days as well today, as I've done last time. So let's get into the game, and Shaggy is now being controlled. Let's jump in. This looks like the outside of the famous Colosseum in Rome. Keep along the walls, Shaggy, and you should be fine. Groovy! A chance to put my balancing skills to work. <laughs> so it seems that we're outside of Rome, which means we'll have to take um, take extra precautions in um, stages like this, since they get even more intense in um, in later levels of the game. So all we need to do is just stay on our toes and focus, and make sure we don't fall off, because I believe certain areas are a bit steep. Surprisingly enough, following the previous um, part of the previous episode of this gameplay walkthrough, we haven't even even came across a death yet, and I really hope we don't because I know that uh, it does get a lot harder as we go. Oops. Those skeletons don't look so friendly, Shaggy. I bet they just hate a pie in their face. <laughs> I bet they would. You know, I thought pies were for dessert. Oh well, here goes. <laughs> Shaggy, always the hungry one, wanting um, pies to eat. Little did he know they were for throwing. However, Daphne had to um, tell him that they were for throwing, not eating. I'd better regain some health because... Ah, um... oh, you hit me again. It wouldn't matter if I didn't defeat all the enemies because... What's important is that we make some swift progress in the game. And make sure we don't die because we've got a total of 14 lives on them right now. Checkpoint. Here we go, full power. Oh god. And it doesn't, like I said also, it doesn't matter if I don't get 100% in this game. The importance is that we smash each and every level of any video game because that's what gameplay walkthroughs are namely meant to be for. Showing our faithful viewers how it's done. Oh, might want to pick up this pie in case, um, in case we come across any more of those bad guys. There we go. Back at full health once again. On the verge of going our 15th life, can we actually kill those with um, a pie? We can't. They just they just pass through. Now I've seen a video on on a long play on this game, and they died in this section whilst trying to um, get stuff in a jar. And I haven't even done that, which is a very fortunate situation. Oh, we've got our 15th life, however. Oh god, that was close. That was close. I thought I was gonna fall to my death, but luckily I didn't. Yeah, we got him. Might want to try and do three of those um, jars in a row. Okay, one, two, three. Boom! There we go. We just need to ensure that we don't fall to our death in those sections because um just trying to collect as many collectibles as I can. Oh god. There we go. Okay. Shh. 
Shaggy, on the other hand, has always been so persistent for food. That's why he's just munching away, as you can hear in the sound effects when I pick up those pies and uh, burgers. Okay. Friends, Romans, and gladiators, lend me your bones. <laughs> <laughs> Shaggy, what on earth are you like? But I do really love that joke that he said there. Friends, Romans, and gladiators, lend me your bones. Sometimes when I'm holding this PS1 controller, my hands seem to get very sweaty, knowing that I might not be able to get a grip on these things anymore. Which is why I'm, which is why I'm having a bit of, a bit, a bit sweaty as of right now, due to complexity. However, we haven't even fallen to our death, nor did we get killed by any of those fiendish um, villains. Okay. Alright. So far so good. Hear something? I believe you did, but it may not be good. Shaggy, that skeleton gladiator's coming after you. Oh god. You'll have to run fast to keep ahead of him. Why, that's easy for you to say, Fred. You're not the one being chased by a bag of bones. Yikes! <laughs> You know, if Scooby was in this, he'd probably be like, ruh -ruh, as of right now. We better get away from that gladiator because he's on because he's on the run after us. It's like it's like a criminal chase in, on TV, like when you like in CSI, you're you're being chased by cops. Well, at least the skeleton gladiator is not even a cop. Cops didn't even exist back in the day, or did they? <laughs> Zoinks! Well, that was lucky. Oh, hold on, there's something in this jar. Pie. That's 14 pies we got. Oh, bottomless pit. Lucky evasion that was. Oh, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. One, two, three. Go. Phew, you made it. I wonder if the phantom virus is in the arena. Grab that box of Scooby Snacks and let's find out. Yeah. Ah, oh, yeah. Yeah, -ha! man, I knew I could do it. So you could, Shaggy. All right, so that's the first level of Ancient Rome completed. And now, with all that, we can move on to the next one. You're inside the Colosseum now, Shaggy, and I'm detecting a lot of danger ahead. Be careful. Like more danger? Does this game ever end? No, there's like seven stages in this game, and three levels per zone. Just be aware of that, Shaggy, yes? This section. <clears throat> so, guys, in case you haven't noticed as well, I've also I'm also focusing on Naruto Shippuden via my blog, Garrett's Anime Reaction Corner. Initially, I was going to uh, react to anime on YouTube, but I won't be able to due to copyright issues. I remember in July I uploaded the first my reaction to the first episode of Dragon Ball Z, but it got blocked worldwide due to copyright. So. Uh, so, um, as a result, I had to open up Garrett's Anime Reaction Corner, which is a blog, but link is in the description below if you want to check that out. I'm currently reacting to Naruto Shippuden. I'm also, um, going for, uh, and also occasionally reacting to, oh god, occasionally reacting to, um, Dragon Ball Z as well. Not to mention my hero, uh, hold on a minute, hold on a minute, hold on a minute, hold on a minute. My Hero Academia. At first I thought it was um, pronounced My Hero Academia. Apparently it's not. It's My Hero Academia. 
so much for uh, just um, rushing into like uh, some kind of pronunciation. Also, I have plans to um, react to Death Note on the blog from New Year's Day. Also, um, I have others to to come as well. But um, I posted an exclusive post on my Anime Reaction Corner blog by a blogger regarding on some of my reactions for 2021. Oh God, skeletons! Let's go eradicate them all. But many more anime is to come very soon on the blog. So I recommend you check out Garrett's Anime Reaction Corner. Again, the link's in the description below. So that means I don't own, uh, I not only have YouTube, I've also got the other depths of social media. Yay! So much for talking to you, uh, much, but we um, fell to our death there. Hopefully we can stay focused, but I need to try and like find a safer way to do this. Like that. Should have thought about that in the first place, to be completely honest, but we haven't gone way too far back. <laughs> Alright. Jump! Yes! We need to regain our 20th life, of which we uh, lost some, uh, what, lost like a minute ago. Sacrifices are somehow easy to make, aren't they? You know what, I think I'm just gonna go across here. We got full power again. We just need another six Scooby Snacks to get our life back. There we go, that's 20 lives we've got again. Okay. There we are. This time don't fall off. And we're out of pies, so we're probably going to want to refrain from attacking unless we use this. Bounce on them. That's the, uh, that's more like the offensive alternative. Alright. One, two, three. We got three pies back. There we go. Phone call from Velma. You did it, Shaggy. You made it to the Coliseum doors. You'll need to go inside and keep looking for the phantom virus. I have a better idea, Velma. Like, why don't I find a nice little cafe and order an anchovy pizza? I'm starved! <laughs> All you want is a pizza, Shaggy. Man! Yaha! Man, I knew I could do it! There we go! That's level 2 complete in ancient Rome. I guess this also means it's time to enter the next level, which is also the third and final of ancient Rome. The boss. You should know better than to mess with me. Now you're trapped. You'll never get out of here in one piece. Hmm. That's what you think. Well, I'm convinced. Now how about someone getting me out of here? It's time to be extra brave, Shaggy. Avoid the spears those skeleton gladiators throw at you and run away from the lion. Wait until he gets tired and then take your chance. Three hits from your pie, and you should have him beat. Hmm. Lions and skeletons and spears. Oh my! <laughs> Lions and skeletons and spears. Oh my! They just they just quoted the Wizard of Oz in Paradise. Lions and tigers and bears. Oh my! But with a bit of a Roman twist. Anyway, enough of my rambling. Let's go take on that lion. Three attacks. Oh god! We gotta watch out for the uh, spears as well. Not by getting hit like that with them, though. Maybe if we run from them, we should be fine. Alright, here we go. Here's the lion. You're going down, MGM. Oh, God. I 
also remember fighting off the lion. I wouldn't know if he was that easy to beat. Come on, get tired already! Uh, if we refrain from taking damage again and again, we should be okay. We need to keep a hold of our 20, li uh, 20 lives. If we can, that is. And by all means cost, uh, by, uh, by all, all means necessary, refrain from taking extra damage. Whoa! They're actually throwing, throwing more than one... One spear, one bomb, one skeleton? Man, how do you live with yourself? I don't even know. Okay. Here he comes again. You missed! Oh god, that time you didn't. If I double jump, I should. I, that should be like my defensive. Man, that was a great strategy, though. Double jump for defense. I meant to do that. Just wanted to see if I can, like... Oh. Wow, I did not expect that. One more hit and then uh, from us and... For us and then... Oh, God, that happened. Oh, got it! We should have won! Oh, well, here we go! Well, attempt two, since, um... Since we got, since we got, um, schooled by that lion. This time we're going to take some extra precautions. You missed me. Missed again. Go ahead, try and finish me all you want. But you'll never touch me. You know the reputation of Shaggy Rogers. Alright, no damage. That's from attempt two. Oh, wow. So, comment below. What do you remember? What's, what's your best Scooby Doo, your favorite Scooby Doo video to direct movie from the past 50 years? Mine has got to be like Scooby Doo and the Legend of the Vampire. You know why? Because it was obviously one of my childhood favorites, and it's like the storyline was absolutely epic of how um, Scooby and the gang fight offended off the Yowie Yahoo. And also, it was like my first um, Scooby Doo um, live director, uh, director, director, director video release, uh, release, even though they were not specifically released in the cinemas initially. The live action feature length ones, however, were. Oh, this is our chance to finish them off! Yes! We've done it! <laughs> that was it. Ha ha ha! Super Shag! Wow, Shaggy, you did it! But the Phantom Virus got away. Come on back and we'll keep looking. There we go! That's the boss defeated. Before we end off the, um, end off this episode, I thought I might want to go ahead and, um, go ahead and save our game. Yeah. There we go. When we come back next time, the next stage will be the Arctic Circle. So, 
thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you want some more of the cracking content for this channel. Don't forget, you can, also, like I said, you can also check out Garen's Anime Reaction Corner. The link is in the description below. That's the home to my anime reactions. Let me know in the comments below. Again, what is your favorite Scooby-Doo um, direct to video home uh, direct to video release? Because, like I said, mine was Scooby-Doo and the Legend of the Vampire. And also, what is, and not only tell me what is your favorite, and tell me why it's your favorite, and like story-wise context or um, whatever. And uh, yeah, with all that, thank you all for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye for now, guys.